How to make a high altitude drone. Hey, JP here. We've been experimenting with hybrids of drones and balloons. The balloon takes the load off the propellers and that opens the way for high altitude flight, while the quad set of propellers gives greater control. Our tandem and micro tandem airships are part of that research. However, there is one that we've been working on in the shop that we haven't shown yet. We call it HiBot. This will be a drone that can fly to 140,000 feet. HiBot is a mix of parts from our other airships and balloon platforms and conventional quad drones. The first thing we made was the ring. The balloon sits on the ring like a scoop of ice cream on a cone. This configuration keeps the balloon stable relative to the structure. The balloon will expand to 62 feet in diameter at peak altitude. We've experimented with a fabric sleeve to protect the balloon from the carbon. <sighs> we can't take Bob anywhere. Here, we're test fitting the structure to the balloon inside the launch bag. We're looking at a six hour flight duration with an all weather launch capability. This means launching in winds up to 45 miles per hour and yep, Using our launch bags, we've tested in those conditions. One of our first uses for the HiBot will be as a camera platform. It will up our game and give us greater control over the all-important shot. We'll also be using it as a test platform for our Airship to Orbit program. It will be a rendezvous target for our Ascender airships at 140,000 feet. We'll be using two different sets of propellers on HiBot, depending on the flight. One set will be conventional. We'll use those when we need most of the maneuvering and power below 15,000 feet. We're now developing a small version of our tandem high altitude propellers. Those we'll use when we need uh, most of the thrust and maneuvering above that. We will be using the same control and telemetry package as on our high rack high altitude vehicles. The biggest part of the whole HiBot program is getting the clearance to fly it. It will definitely be flying over the 400 foot max altitude for drones. But we're talking with the FAA and working through all that. Okay, when will it fly? You know, we are always working on lots of different vehicles in the shop. When one gets close to completion, we focus on it. The Ellipse airship is getting close to first flight, and our submarine, Bellavia, is getting close to first dive. We'll complete HiBot after those two events happen. So, we're looking at a late 2023 liftoff. 
please hit the subscribe button. It really helps us keep doing the crazy things we do. And thank you for watching.